Come on now, gang. We got to make it make sense. How you first comment, but not first like? First comment, get a cash app prize. I respect you for, you know, coming and volunteering that shit, you know. Um, shout out to you. The video didn't make sense. Let's see. Trying to run two million up like P. Good afternoon. I'm sorry. Nah, this Cater ain't that white dude. Jackson, the white dude that's Jackson doing Sheriff's nonsense, Office homicide bro. unit. At around 7.30 this morning, a concerned citizen phoned 911 saying there was a deceased female in a vacant lot in the 1700 block at Pickettville Road. The Jacksonville Sheriff's Office patrol units, along with our air unit and the Jacksonville Fire and Rescue, responded to this area and located an adult white female deceased. Due to the circumstances, the Jacksonville Sheriff's Office Homicide Unit, Crime Scene Unit, and our partners with the State Attorney's Office are currently on scene conducting this investigation. At this time, we have no information besides what the concerned citizen called, called in saying that they were able to locate her. I'm not going to lie. All that Instagram posting, I feel like it's done for a reason. Um, money. I feel like it's, 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 it's more of a financial game than whoever's playing on this Instagram. I wouldn't assume it's one of his homeboys. Matter of fact, I take the lie back. I wouldn't assume it's his mama off the off the, the, the trolling that's getting done. Like like a grown woman, I just can't see her doing no shit like that. You know what I mean? So I think it's one of his homeboys that's doing it. Or a manager or something. Like but but it's money. It, it's all it's all for money. You know how you got that washcloth and you wanna wring it out? Get every bit of uh, water out that motherfucker. That's what's going on. That's what's going on. They, they, they trying to get every, every, yeah. Me personally, I don't feel like it's right though. But it's like a, a more to each his own type thing. And they got buried in forces. I respect them. You know they, 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 they having them in some forces, bro. Bro, this is not the nineties, bro. Niggas are not getting buried in Stacey Adams no more, bro. <laughs> Niggas ain't getting buried in no Stacey Adams. I, I wish the fuck they would put a nigga in Stacey Adams, bro. The nigga still in his twenties. Come on, man. I respect the forces. And was that Lee Supreme? I gotta get me a pair of them bitches. I don't know if they were Supreme or not. I can't I can't say. I can I cannot say. But I respect the force move. Like I'm hunting everybody involved. That's what I'm saying. I want a Stacy Stacy Adam wearing suit wearing ass nigga. Don't even do that. Don't even do all that. Like put me in something, you know I'm a, I'm a rock. Like something, Ralph. Some little alligator. They call it Lacoste. Yeah. Put me on some. You know I'm going to rock the shit out that shit. You fuck with Sketch? <laughs> What's good, brother? <laughs> Hold on. What's up, brother? Yes. When I'm dead, three, I Give me the power, I beg of you. Julio funeral is back the fuck up. Y'all see this shit? Oh, God. It's back the fuck up. They got this locked the fuck Like, they ain't playing no game. That's what I'm talking You know he gay? Now, I told y'all on the last video. Why did that? Hold on. Hold on. Why does that matter to me? Please. Who said that? Damn, Clip. I don't want to be in you. But you, I got I got to I got to I got to But look, though. That's his shit. I didn't even know that was a thing. So I didn't even go looking for no bullshit like that. Niggas ain't even go looking for no bullshit like that, bro. Hey, look. I don't even care. You know why? That's, that's his shit. It is wild, though. I'm not, I'm not going to lie. It's some wild ass facts. But... I don't give a fuck. Yeah, he confirmed and he said he changed. Damn, buddy ain't said shit yet. No, no, he gonna have to wear that jacket for life. Not gonna lie. Not gonna lie. Buddy gonna have to wear that jacket for life. But, 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 look, it don't matter. We gotta, we gotta treat that like a whole jacket. Like, we gonna have to wear that whole for life, you know? Hell yeah. His office. We're currently on scene conducting this investigation. At this time, we have no information. So we besides already what the talked about who was posting. Called, called in saying that they more, were able to more locate so her. Like a car, when I'm dead, three, I a homeboy. Give me the power, I beg of you. Julio funeral is back the fuck up. Y'all see this? Sh oh God, it's back the fuck up. They got this locked the fuck like they ain't playing no game. That's why. I'm now I told y'all on the last video that I did with Julio Fulio then I probably wouldn't be speaking on the situation again. But over the past couple of days, people have been running with the craziest conspiracy theories. But today they learned that everything is not a conspiracy. The top op of Jacksonville, Florida is officially gone. I don't know who been running his Instagram account oh my God. ever since the day he passed away, but I'm pretty it. I'm reading the chat for the people that's watching the video. It said, I thought Lil, Cla Lil Cracker and Fulio didn't like each other because of Fulio. 
Hey man, if if niggas if niggas was homies like they they portrayed to be out on the internet, uh, falling out shouldn't shouldn't keep you from going to that funeral unless it was some real fucked up shit. Um, although they might not been on good terms, him and him, him and him and Buddy might still had that 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 friendship or something. I don't know, but when that death involves, you don't know what the fuck about to go on. You know, shit. You see how many people that was bagged up in the funeral? Shit, he probably had. More enemies than friends in that fucking funeral. You don't know. You don't fucking know, bro. You know, but when it comes to that death, bro, my fucking on uh, death brings people out type shit. In lack of better words, bro, it's your, la it's your last time, the last, the last. It's the last. You feel me? So you don't, you don't know. You don't, you don't know uh, what it could be. You just gotta see it. See, you see the actions and see the, see the, see the moves and shit. You know. Of Jacksonville, Florida is officially gone. I don't know who been running his Instagram account. Hey, while he was here, while he was here, I don't think I ever called Buddy the top op. With that being said, after shit transpired to hide, you know, what it did, I saw it. I finally saw it. You know, like it was, it was a real, we waited for this day type of vibe. It was crazy. It was crazy. Ever since the day Some he passed shit, away, Instagram. but I'm pretty sure y'all will meet again because you going to hell, fam. Yesterday, footage released of Julio Fulio's casket. And if I'm going to be real, it's kind of morbid that it was even on the internet in the first place. But I must admit, he's going out in style. But today, many fans spotted Julio Fulio's carriage carrying him to his final resting place. I see this on God back the fuck. They got this blocked the fuck off like they ain't playing no game. That's what I'm talking about. Y'all wow. Now, I would think that they would want to make his final resting place a private event simply because of what he did on other people's grave sites when they passed away. He killed this and on me. What happened? Now we smoking 23. <laughs> this 2024, these young guys. That's some old shit that probably is about to transpire, bro. Nah, that wasn't them. That was that was Baton Rouge. My bad. My bad. But somebody, yeah, you know that that whole grace it got fucked up. Like, but you know what I'm talking about. It's the um, it happened down in Baton Rouge. I was about to mix up the two. Guys is claiming to be demons, so I would not be surprised if somebody decided to urinate or even defecate on this man's final resting stone. The people who ran Julio Fulio's Instagram account, a lot of people are saying it's his mom, a lot of people are saying it's his girlfriend. Well, they didn't even wait one day before trolling Young and Ace. And this would lead conspiracy theorists to believe that Young and Ace is still alive. Now, ever since we experienced the first hip hop death, they always try to say the person- Hold on, he say that wrong? Did he say that wrong or why tripping? Day before trolling Young and Ace. Final rep, folk. These young guys is claiming to be demons. So I would not be surprised if somebody decided to urinate or even defecate on this man's final resting stone. The people who ran Julio Fulio's Instagram account, a lot of people are saying it's his mom. A lot of people are saying it's his girlfriend. Well, they didn't even wait one day before trolling Young and Ace. And this would lead conspiracy theorists to believe that Young and Ace is still alive. Now, ever since we experienced right, the first hip hop death, let's just let's just take out Ace and put Fulio there because I think that's what he meant. They always try to say the person who got killed is still alive. When Tupac died, they said he was still alive. King Von got killed, and they said he was still alive. Now, here it is today. We got a sanctified, self-proclaimed demon that was always on demon time laying in his final resting place. I heard this version. This the alien mix. And up until this that was the alien mix, my point, nigga. All up. because of his <laughs> girlfriend or mama was on his Instagram page trolling, they led fans to believe that he was still alive. Now, I hope the reality <laughs> out there for all the young guys watching this video is gonna hit y'all. Look, 
You don't get a second chance to come back to life. This ain't a video game, fam. This ain't GTA. But of course, you the don't internet no gonna always cards. do its thing. The internet gonna yeah. get to internet. Now, it's alleged that one of the guys who the internet said killed Julio Fulio was at his service. Now, that's not even the most disturbing information for today. As y'all heard from the video clipping in the beginning of this segment, one of those girls that dropped that location. Two, three. Good afternoon. See, I'm sorry. always Jump. the bitch with the prettiest face you gotta watch. You always gotta watch the bitch with the prettiest face. Bitch, your face that pretty and you a fucking devil. I fucking knew it. I fucking knew it. Yo. Oh, shit. But hold on. How they knew it was her that leaked the no location? Disturbing though? information for the day. As y'all heard from though, the video. Look, though. You, if you sit there and peek. You see how many phones is out? Already alarming. I ain't gonna lie. Clipping in the beginning of this segment, one of those girls that dropped that location. Two, three. Good afternoon. I'm Sergeant Josh Cater with the Jacksonville Sheriff's Office Homicide Unit. At around 7.30 this morning, a concerned citizen phoned 911 saying there was a deceased female in a vacant lot in the 1700 and citizen called, called in saying that they were able to locate her. I heard from the sheriff she was a little white girl. So that ought to let y'all know what type of timing they on. They literally down a girl who was accused of dropping a location on the day the man got buried. It's finna be a hot summer in Jacksonville, bro. I'm not trying to racial bait, but when killers is willing to take down a white girl, you know they mean business, dog. Nah, if I was young and ace, I would get up out of Dodge. Five in the morning, I got a car. But from the looks of it, if a white girl fuck that, y'all been watching that nigga gaming videos. It ain't even in the videos itself. It's it's GTA. Excuse me, it's GTA at the end of, at the end of the day. It's the thumbnails that's fucking me up. It's the thumbnails. Hey, we changed your ace name to Mister Don't Give a Fuck, man. Hey, the titles go crazier. I forgot about the titles. I forgot about the okay, titles. Escape it, say brother. I don't think you're going to be able to escape it either. But who knows? Because like I said, it's alleged that one of the internet suspects, let me say that again, internet suspects, was seen around the vicinity of Julio's final resting place. What is wrong with y'all, bruh? Never in a million years did I think the generation that came after me would be on this type of timing. As I stated in the previous video, the first one I did about Julio, it's like y'all don't even have a notion of the afterlife. Y'all don't even have a notion of right or wrong, heaven or hell. When I was a kid, we stood on certain principles and morals. For example, we wasn't allowed to play loud music while passing by a cemetery. We wasn't allowed to point at a cemetery. The guy who we're talking about today, Julio Fulio, has 10 music videos inside of a cemetery. And one of those music videos is the reason why he is at where he is today. He kept this on me. What happened? Now he's See, I hate people that keep using this as an example for whatever happened to Fulio, bro. What we know, what we not, what we not putting to the forefront. That this nigga hand was forced to do this shit. Uh, why are we forgetting that that important fact? The nigga hand was forced to do this type of shit. Do we all like? Do we all forget that that part? He wasn't only beefing, beefing with man. Fuck all that. We forget that 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 the nigga hand was forced to do this shit. Do I hold on? Do let's do our homework right here. Cause I ain't heard Whopper with the chopper verse in a long time. Hold on. Who I smoke? It's his homework right here. Y'all, we forget that this nigga here was forced for that shit. He had to go. He had to do something. Time, but you when I see you, I'ma your shit back, boy. Time to get to spin through your set. We don't fight. 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 We don't f
my nigga Max to that mom. Motherfucker, free you. Knock a nigga out. Boy, you can get, get your, your ass, ass beat too. Oh, you tripping. He just basically told you, you either way, you gonna get beat the fuck up. Knock your ass out or I'm gonna just beat your ass. One of the two. I'm still gonna beat your ass either way it go. But anyway... Let's get back to the original video. We, we not, we not, we not, we not, we not acknowledging the fact that although he, this was a wrong, this was a wrong, going to this funeral, not funeral, going to the cemetery and doing all this, it was a wrong. God damn it, it was done reasoning behind this shit because the other wrong. We got, we got to acknowledge that fact, bro. We keep bringing up him being in the cemetery, making a music video and all that. He only did that to, hey, the nigga harmonized who I smoked. So elegant, hey, so nicely, bro. He had to do something. They got me fucked up. I'm already knowing he had had that whole discussion with him and his boys. They got me fucked up. Truth be told, fully owes who I smoke bump to. I ain't never heard that shit. I ain't gonna lie. But yeah, I just want to, I just want to, you know, at least throw that in the mix of the commentary, you know? Like, yeah, the nigga did some fucked up shit, but it wasn't just for no reason wrong heaven or hell when i was a kid we stood on certain principles and morals for example we wasn't allowed to play loud music while passing by a cemetery we wasn't allowed to point at a cemetery the guy who we're talking about today julio fulio fuck it oh shit who i smoke fulio i can name over 30 dead off no count me and downtown Right, we got about 20 seconds on this shit. I was the name Hood the same night. I'm trying to get a dog to the arms. Let's play Fortnite. Sure got killed. No, you wish he had a new bike. Sure. Nate got killed. No, you wish he had a new life. See it so you smoke as fast. Meet you, that's a new pack. Rollo died with itself. I'm talking about the first two bars was crazy. The first two bars was insane. God damn. But back to my. They forced his hand with this shit. Oh, shit. Fuck. They forced his hand with this shit if y'all think about it. Has 10 music videos inside of a cemetery. And one of those music no, videos. No, hold on. Hold on. Hold up. When I see you, when I see you, this special, because he really remixed Fantasia on the air. Is the reason why he is at where he it's is It's already today. a hood. Hey. He kept this on me. No bullshit. No bullshit. I got to get a nigga credit. He gave this song new life. You know what I mean? He gave that when I see your new life. That bitch was already bought, but then he dropped that shit. It was just went more crazy. What happened? Now we smoking 23. <laughs> Let this be a lesson to all my young listeners out there. You are not a demigod. When them hollow tips hit your back, you have a 50% chance of living. When them hollow heads hit your tater, say, bro, might just meet your maker. Now, here it is. Not even a day after the service, somebody got gunned down. Jacksonville is just heavily in the news right now. Also, ATK member Queso and Scotty got their charges upgraded to murder one by a gang member, an update that happened after the death of Julio Fulio. So it's safe to say that law enforcement not playing out there, bro. If y'all wanna be hidden behind the penitentiary for the next 55 years, or if you wanna go to the upper room and meet the guy that made us all, Keep on. Don't change nothing. Keep on doing what you're doing. But I know y'all won't take heed. I know y'all some little demons. I know that if somebody put that gleesh on your ass, you gonna have your girlfriend troll on Instagram even after you dead. Why? Because we live in a monkey see, monkey do universe now. Like what mama used to that say. That makes sense if that it's girls posting. Like I said, it's a financial situation, bro. Bro, if they posting, doing all that posting on that man's Instagram for free, for nothing, for nada. It makes me look at them weird. You feel me? Because what's the reason now? What's the reason now? I can't see it. I can't see a valid reason now. The troll? Trolling ain't even that fun. All that. All that fun to be, yeah. Trolling ain't all that fun to be. And and, and for it to be seeing, mi like, millions of people seeing this shit. I'm talking about everything that's get done on, on, that, on, that, on that Instagram account. It's on just about every, every blog. It either get sent out. God damn, I see it. I, I don't even follow Fulio, bro. And I see it still. Seriously, though. But honestly, though, I'd rather that than a GoFundMe. I mean, like I said, if it ain't no financial gain behind it, bro, and it's just for free. Because at the end of the day, I, I said earlier, I said, shit, you know that that, that wash rag with that with the last bit of water you trying to get out? God damn it, that's what, that's what they got going. 
They trying to, because in a year or two from now, they're going to be getting music checks off of Fulio. Whatever, whatever his music checks are. Whatever his music checks are. Hopefully, 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 whoever's the, uh, the overseer of the music, because I'm pretty sure he got shit that's in the tuck, videos that ain't dropped yet, if he was working right, figure out a way to package that together and, 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 and for it to be successful, you know, package that shit together and, 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 and drop it, you know, because at the end of the day, he did, he did have supporters that fucked with his music, bro. One last Fulio album is damn near what they, yeah. He said he got over like 15 unreleased videos and 120 songs. If it's music videos that they got, them shit's bound to hit like an M, touching an M. If it's like one of them motherfuckers that disrespectful, definitely. I don't know why, uh, I don't know about the, cause bro, I am not going to sit here and cap y'all down, bro. The Holiday Inn is such a peculiar, peculiar, peculiar choice of hotels, bro. And I'm only going off how I can live. You feel me? I, I don't really know what, what Fulio got going, but, bro, I'm not at the Holiday Inn. The last time I stayed at the Holiday Inn was um three, four years ago. Mind you, it wasn't even my choice. You know? It was more of a, oh, okay, I got this bread here. I pay for me and your shit. It was on some family timing. But when it's my choice, I'm put up in like a, a apartment, B&B, um, to fuck it up. You spending that money on a good hotel to fuck it up? Yes. Because the good hotel come with peace of mind, bro. That's what I'm really paying for. I ain't paying for the, okay, I am paying for the amenities. I ain't gonna lie. <laughs> I can't even sit here and say that. But at the end of the day, I'm paying for the peace of mind, though. You know what I mean? I'm paying for the peace of mind. I ain't I ain't paying for the uh the name or nothing like that. I know this motherfucker put up out the way. I ain't got to worry about shit. So yes, I am. Once I get kicked out the B and B, I'm going home. No cap. Shit, bro. He in Tampa. Tampa's one of them cities. I know they got it. I know they got some shit sitting by water. I know they got some extravagant shit. It's Florida by uh, uh at the end of the day. Florida always got some extravagant shit you can go to. But yeah, we paying for the peace of mind. Not really. You know, we paying for both. We paying for both. Peace of mind and the goddamn the amenities, you know? Hell yeah. Uh, did you see this the uh, video of the shooting? Yes! Saw it! Um, dead to rights, bro. Dead to rights. And, and somebody mentioned that he wasn't even driving? Yeah, dead to rights. Dead to rights, bro. They came up. I don't know. Hey, look! I don't know why they ain't trying to run that motherfucker with the, with the charger. Shit, y'all already getting... Yeah! What up? And it's a 392 motherfucker. I would have... <laughs> Bullets hitting the chest and no, I ain't gonna lie. Something gotta happen, bro. This, this my last year. Some some stupid gotta happen. Ran that motherfucker over with the charger. Fuck him. Nah, dead ass though. He came out the cut like they ain't expected. They did. He moved. Nah, they could have they could have ripped that curve or something. It's like they ran around that bitch trying to get away. Nah, but on some real shit though. Shit, they had they had they had buddy dead the rice, bro. And and I'm not gonna lie. The more you look at that video, it, it looked like. Somebody did drop a location or something, bro. Because you see how we talking about this Holiday Inn? Like, I'd never stay there. Shit. How the fuck did they know he was there? You know? Something stupid did happen. Nigga broke the axle. They know what whip. That nigga got the most common whip ever. 392 Charger? No bullshit. I can go to 38th Street, put a chair right there, sit there, and just watch these bitches pass by. 10 minutes, I'm watching 10 392s ride past me, bro. That bitch is the most common car out there. Charger, 392. Everybody named mama got one or want one. And on top of that, he fobbed all the way around. How you know per, How you know exactly that's him? He fobbed all the way around. Tense. 5% tense all the way around. How you feel on school? I, 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 I'm not familiar with school. I heard about that shit too, but I'm not familiar. Bro, just to mind, I mind y'all, we've been on this same video for about 30 minutes. Yeah. Shout out to my boy Glenn. Oh, uh, shit. His windows cooked. Ain't no way they knew it was him. Yes. I'm feeling the same way. He got shot in the car, too. Really supposed to duck your head near the engine block and step on it? Nah, that's about, that's about to... I ain't even gonna call it the safest bet. But, shit. That, yeah. That is damn near the safest bet. Because the bullets gotta go through the engine block. It's some shit them get through them engine blocks, though. I don't think you just 100% safe. It depends on the engine you got, because you got like a little four-cylinder 2JZ or something. Nah, that's a six-cylinder. Goddamn a four-cylinder Honda engine, VTEC or some shit. I don't know how safe you could be with that little motherfucker. Uh, that's the same car 
I'm gonna go. Yeah. Moral of the story is that nigga had the most commonest, commonest car you can get right about now. 392, uh, 392 Charger. Ain't like he had like a uh a, a track hawk, big ass, big ass logo on the side. You know, he had some some cool regular shit. Your friend jump off the bridge, you gonna jump off behind them? These guys is. They will jump off behind them. Look, YouTube family, the summer is just beginning. And y'all already know when it get hot. Bodies drop oh, in like fifth Smooth. Smooth. It's summertime. It's been a lot of money. Season. It's hot out with this bitch. That's a good enough reason. No cap. Every summer. I said this in the last video. Every summer, you can almost guarantee that one of your close buddies is going Go to the, the upper room. Especially if you off in them streets. Now, if you a square, you know what I mean? And you work at Home Depot, you go to church. You don't really have to worry about this. But to all my young guys that like the- Why do niggas have to be squares, bro? If you're a regular and you go to church, Home Depot, what's wrong with you saying that? Hell yeah. Pour up the green lean and pop the yerkies and be hanging outside with a G23. Say, man, look around, look, look next to your neighbor. I want you to say, neighbor? One of us is going to die this summer. Facts. Y'all just heard an adult white woman was gunned down. So what you think they're going to do to y'all black ass? Male in a vacant lot in the 1700 block at Pickettville Road. The Jacksonville Sheriff's Office patrol units, along with our air unit and the Jacksonville Fire and Rescue, responded to this area and located an adult white female. Boy, she crazy. Now, it's alleged she crazy that the girl that was gunned down was the one who dropped the location. But that's just silly to me because... Julio Fulio's last live video was literally him dropping his own location. My birthday is oh, the time of it's over lit. Oh, God, yeah. We can't do my birthday, man. Everybody talking about the smell. You know what I'm saying? 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 Deep as hell. Lit everywhere we go. Got me drinking, cuz. I don't need drink, cuz. Oh. <laughs> we just got her, bro. Now, that would lead a lot of people to say that he went out by suicide by op, which is crazy still to me. That's a crazy terminology. Ooh, but that? that's the world that we live no, in. Stop, he made that shit up. Who the fuck said that? You, you did. You see the video when Ice Spice approved she was tired of twerking? No, she, it's too late for her to be tired of twerking. Fuck. Bitch, you ain't got as used to it. Hold up. You can't renege on that now. Fuck. You ain't sat there and got us used to this little yellow motherfucking swing side to side. Boom. And then you cover that. Yeah, bitch, we used to all that now. You can't just stop. Fuck. You just can't renege on that shit. Hold up. We need to get her on the phone. I'm just playing. I'm just playing. But, uh, yeah, let's keep this video going, bro. Are I really thought done. of. Repercussions? Ah, forget <laughs> about it. It's as if these guys never heard one of the first universal sayings. What goes around comes around. As above, as it is below. Now, because you didn't want to take heed to plenty of people lecturing you, I'm sure your mama lectured you. Because you wouldn't take heed, you are now living below the earth let this be a lesson to all of y'all young cats out there while it may be entertaining seeing these guys go through this type of turmoil these are real life situations real life situations that you can really end up in if you continue letting people control your narrative hey bro the streets ain't for you leave them say the streets been dead ain't no money in the streets no more only killing the young man is that's another thing I don't know if this buddy be, be really be outside for real like he's trying to portray. But it's money everywhere, bro. It's still money everywhere. It's 2025. It's more money than anything. Now, that's what you choose to see or that's what you choose to kind of pick up from what's going on out here. Hey, that is what it is. But it's more than killing going on. It's money getting made. It's hoes getting fucked. It's, it's, a, it's a lot going on out here, bro. It's a lot going on out here, bro. It's still the same shit. I feel like there's more money in the streets than ever. Like the bricks, the bricks, you know, motherfuckers still sell their drugs and shit. But hold on. They had this, it's a whole new wave of scam shit going on. So many different motherfuckers trying to uh, utilize their gifts that, hold on, bro. You know how all the street niggas are drug dealers and shit got these cars and shit. It's niggas that's, that's paying them bitches $10,000 a pop. That nigga get four, four or five of them bitches in a month. Oh, I forgot about the online 
trapping. Telegram. It's niggas getting peas through Telegram, bro. Selling them bitches through Telegram. Getting them in through Telegram. It's so much money in the streets. You talking about ain't no money in the streets. It's crazy. It's crazy. Being carried and wheeled inside <laughs> of a church in order for his family members to say their final goodbyes. And what's more demonistic than that Daughter, what's going is on? that they're saying that one of the internet quote unquote Look, killers. You see how this, you see how this, that's street money at the end of the day. Well, well fully it was music money, but still though. How many street niggas dying? You see that? That's a. We're seen around the service. Now, this would not surprise me because those Chicago guys, they be on that same type of timing. As a matter of fact, I think I've seen a Chicago video where these guys walked inside of the funeral oh, service. Oh, the striker shit. Grab More money get made in the street. Grab the man's casket. Yeah, buddy just talking. Mom. I ain't gonna lie. Walk the casket out the funeral. Dump the body on the ground. Say, you little niggas is going to hell. I ain't gonna lie, I hope that there's a hell so they can send your little ass down there. So no, it wouldn't be surprising to me that one of the alleged quote unquote killers were at the funeral service. As I always like to remind y'all from Little Rock, Arkansas, bro, don't nothing surprise me when it come down to what these young niggas will and will not do when it comes down to this type of shit. But I would be remiss if I didn't say, man, I wish y'all would just stop it, bro. Young and Ace, last video I made, I tried to give you some good advice, but it seems as though you ain't taking it. Go in the car when I'm dead, three I don't you know that people are already making thumbnails with Young and Ace dead written in a text? People is already preparing so for your demise so to make content, young man. Don't say it, hey, not say, so proof. If, if you're going to continue to act this way, shit, I think I'm going to make me one too. Nah, I'm just playing, but, but all jokes aside. Come on, bro. You was supposed to show proof right there to kind of solidify your statement right then. Now I say you lying on. That was crazy. A Caucasian female has been dropped for dropping that location. Earlier in this week, surveillance video of the shooting was released. Now, I'm not gonna play that here, but it is on other places on YouTube. Go ahead and find it for yourself. And I must say, the shooters were very tactical and it wasn't like they just caught him lacking. They knew where he was going to be at the exact precise time, which leads me to believe that, yeah, he did go online and say, if you want the location, I got you, hit the DM, woo woo woo. But the way they were positioned, it does seem to me as though somebody dropped that location and backdoed them. Say, man, it's getting hot out there. Y'all pray for Jacksonville. Jump in the comment section that right probably, now. Uh, that was probably the smartest thing he ain't said. And say, long live Julio Fulio. Stay up out of Dodge, bro. Alright, I'm done with this video, man. Uh, I just seen a video of somebody, somebody on No Jumpers talking about 67 people. 67 people have passed since this whole situation. Still ain't heard nothing from that. I don't know if that's true or not. Um, yeah, I don't even know what else to say. Violence is never going to stop. I feel bad for the people in that environment. Damn, where happened to the salt and vinegar one? How do you feel about Adam interviewing Pop's killer? Uh, ha has he interviewed anybody else's killer? If so, I don't feel no way. If he just sat there and picked and chose that one guy that's a killer, then... Yeah, I feel a little way, but shout out for the bits. Shout out for the bits. Appreciate you. First time this happened. Uh, I mean, damn, you going crazy. How much these bits worth? Three bits, three bits, four bits, three bits, four bits. Shout out for the bits, bro. I appreciate that shit. I mean, if he sat there and pick and choose that one, that one person out of everybody else to interview, I ain't gonna lie, because it, it, it looked weird on your part because you're sitting there picking and choosing. Now, if he interviewed, I'm talking about it. Anybody else that's been not even accused, but actually killed somebody in a stature and goddamn it got away with the shit. Yeah, I can't really feel no way. But if he pick and choose that one guy, it's, yeah, it looks it looks weird. Like he, yeah, <laughs> what's up, brother? Well, from that, I appreciate you from the home city, sir. Sir Statics, appreciate the sub. It was a gifted sub. I appreciate the gifted sub, man. All right, y'all ready to do this Vaughn off seventeen hundred? Are you on? Or y'all want to hit some music right quick? Cause it's some new shit that drop. Yeah, what's the new shit that drop? Uh, and it'll make young niggas wanna crash. Cause you today can get an interview after juvenile life. Babyface, C, check court, court right quick. Discord. I mean, so y'all thinking all these little interviews, all these little moments that's happening all over the internet. 
Y'all think that shit got real influence over the youth? Like, like these, like these, what's, what's the, like these 11 year olds, who are 11 right now? All the 11 year olds right now, all the, the, the 12 year olds, 13 year olds right now, within the next four or five years, they gonna be the ones that's doing all the spilling and killing, you know? I mean, in my opinion, bro, I just feel like it's all the same, bro. It's all the same. I don't know, some of y'all grew up in the hood, but the same shit that's going on has been going on. And I don't feel like it's no worse, because they always had fully automatic weapons, bro. When you go when you go back to the to the niggas that's in, that when you go back to the 80s babies, not the 80s babies, the niggas that was out outside in the 80s, from the niggas that was outside in the 70s, they was doing killings too. They was doing, they was doing they had, and they had automatic weapons. Back in the early 80s, bro, you can walk in a gun store if you had the cheese, the chip, the buy automatic weapon, you could get could have got that bitch. I forgot the name of the law, but it's um 1984. 1984, they they stopped, they stopped, they stopped the the uh the sale of automatic weapons. So any any gun built before 1984, I can if I got the chip, if I'm willing to spend that chip, I can have an automatic AK. That bitch like 60 bands. But if I'm willing to spend that chip on that automatic AK, goddamn it, I got it within a day's time. They had Mac 10s and shit. Like that's what I'm saying. So y'all think this this switchy epidemic is a epidemic? Switchy pandemic uh is the cause of all the bullshit that's going on today. It's not. It's been the same in my opinion. I just feel like it's more televised. I just feel like it's more yeah, televised, broadcasted off of the um the internet. Off of the internet. 20 years ago, I would have never heard a story from... What's a wild story that happened recently, bro? Let's say the whole Fulio Jacksonville shit, bro. Unless that shit made the news in my area, I would have never heard about that shit 20 years ago. I would have never heard about that shit 20 years ago. Never. The difference is really uh, the I don't give a fuck levels are just lower. No, it's been niggas not giving a fuck. How you think Buddy able to claim 40 bodies? Mind you, these bodies was done in the 80s and 90s. How the fuck you think Buddy's able to claim 40 bodies? I really do feel like all of it's the same. Yeah, it was some real serial quick killers back then. Mind you, this the shit that niggas are getting caught for, bro. You know how many, you know how many murders and shit happen that nobody get caught for? It's all the same shit, in my opinion, bro. It's just more broadcast and 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 and, and Yeah. I'ma fuck with you later, big bro. I don't even know why you did that. How did you doing that to yourself? Sprites never went with Takis. And on top of that, you eat Takis, bro. No sandwich, no nothing. You's a different demon. Hey, but look, more power to you, bro. That's how I know I'm getting old. I can't even eat hot shit no more. Man, I used to be able to eat hot fries with the extra with the extra hot Cheetos, bro. Throw that bitch on the sandwich with hollow. Nah, like, no dead ass, bro. Dead ass. To mix them two hot chips together with a hey look. With a motherfucking with a motherfucking sandwich, throw the chips on the sandwich with jalapenos, bro. Bro, that would that would be like my little yeah. Hey, wouldn't be too fucked up. That's hey, all this hot shit. Nine days, nine days. I might I might could fuck with a uh. I might could fuck with a uh. Some hot fries, you know? Hell no, nah, they added a different type of powder on them hoes. What's the word, snore? Now we just in this whole kicking it. Um, how that happen? The motherfucker. Right.